Oh, I'm so sorry I was late. Were you waiting for me long? Uh, I'm just glad they didn't make you wait for me and let you sit down at the table. Oh, you already ordered for us. Uh, you are the best. I'm starving. I'm happy to see you, too. How was your day? <laughs> you always go to that bookstore. I swear, you must have read every book in there by now. <laughs> no, I know, I know you're right. Reading does make you a stronger writer. You are also the best writer of anyone I know, though. I mean, that novel he just finished was amazing. I read the whole thing in one sitting. I couldn't put it down. I really wish that you would submit it for publication. I really think you can do it. <laughs> I think most artists experience that feeling. All I know is, I think you're amazing. You're my favorite author, even if you aren't published yet. <laughs> I love you. What did I do to get so lucky? You're cute. <laughs> Smart. And you're the most considerate person I know. Plus, those eyes. Oh, I can't get enough of you. I could just stare into them forever. Uh huh. I said you're the most considerate person I know. Are you okay, babe? You. You look a little flushed. Do you want me to go ask them to wrap up our meal to go? Uh, we can go back to my apartment. Uh, maybe eat there and call it a night early if you're tired. Okay. Yeah, if you're sure. It's an option, though. <laughs> of course I care. You're my person. Yeah, actually, uh, today was okay. Uh, the shop was good. I worked on restocking a few of my more popular items. Nothing too interesting. Oh, actually get this. A vampire came into the shop. She wanted me to consider doing business with her over another supplier. It was a very... <laughs> enriching conversation. Say what you will about vampires. But they're determined, and they do drive a very hard bargain. She brought me some very unique items to identify. Which reminds me, I'll need to hop back to Fairy for a tiny bit. I have a buyer there I need to meet with. Will you be okay in the shop by yourself? I said nothing interesting happened at work. Are you sure you were okay? Do you need some water? We, we really can go home. We can try going out later. I'm just, I'm getting worried. No, no, you're right. Uh, well, hopefully the food will get here soon, regardless. Uh, what do you mean? <laughs> of course my hair has always been this color. It, yeah, you're asking a lot of questions about me tonight. This 
isn't how that evening went. <sighs> Let's try something else. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? <laughs> Although, I, I don't think beautiful is a strong enough word. It's, it's perfect. I mean, the sun is shining. The birds are singing. You and me holding each other as we lay in the grass, surrounded by wildflowers. I couldn't imagine a more perfect moment if I tried. This is something out of a fairy tale. <laughs> oh, really? Then how would you describe this moment, a oh wordsmith? You're far more eloquent with words than I. <laughs> you do have a way with words. <sighs> no matter how many times I hear that, I'll never get over it. She was right. You really are a wordsmith. I said you have a way with words. No, no, please, please don't get up. That was such a sweet moment. You were holding me without me even having to ask. No, wait, pet, I... I was really hoping that we could salvage this. I picked some really good memories this time. But, I guess not. We'll just go ahead and stop you right there. Where were you even running to? This is your own head. We've been seeing so much improvement since I started doing this, at least. You don't flinch away from me as often. <laughs> you let me touch your cheek. Just like this. <sighs> I love that. You're so soft and warm. And you talk a lot more than you used to. I love hearing your voice. I love listening to you. You always have something interesting to say. I just wish everything was progressing a little bit faster. That person is just so ingrained in your memories. I thought transposing myself into these memories would help. I thought replacing her in your mind with me would help fix this. But you just keep seeing through it. I don't understand. I want this to work, pet. I want to let you go back to your favorite bookstore without fear of you trying to run away. I want you to start writing again. You used to do those things when you were with her. I want you to do those things with me, too. I'm worried about you. You've been settling in, sure, but but that charm is starting to have a physical effect on you. 
it's, it's too strong. I want you to be able to have your memories back. I just want you to have them back without her haunting you as she does. <sighs> you know, some of the other fae think that I should just give up and start over with a new mortal. <laughs> Though that's really easier for them to say. They've been getting their humans while the humans are still small. The mortals don't even know anything beyond fairy. I don't want that, though. I love the mortal realm. You're all so cute and tiny. And you just do the silliest things. I chose to leave Fairy and be here. I'm happy I have a mortal I didn't need to raise. One who just needed someone to love them unconditionally. <laughs> so imagine how I felt when I saw you walk past my shop for the first time. With those... Beautiful eyes of yours. I needed you. You are perfect for me. And I'm perfect for you. We need each other. <laughs> and those other Fae, they just don't understand. You aren't just any mortal to me. You're special. You're mine. And I'm not just going to return you like you're some dysfunctional product. We are going to make this work. It's just going to take more time. I know I can fix those pesky memories. And when we finally figure all of this out, everything is going to be perfect. We'll get to be together. We'll get to be happy. And when that happens, all of this will have been worth it. I'm not giving up on you, pet. For now, though, I'll let you get back to your dreams. We've done a lot tonight. You need the rest. We'll try again tomorrow. And the day after. And the day after. And the day after. And the day.